Disney Magic features an overview is coming up next. Planning to sail from Miami? If yes, then here are the five things that you must know before boarding Disney Magic. Number one, it's one of the Magic class cruises that sailed for the first time in 1998 and was renovated in 2018. Number two, you'll be sailing with 2,400 other guests. Number three, on board there are plenty of entertainment venues, slides, as well as complimentary and specialty dining venues. Number four, the itinerary includes two to 14 nights of sailing from San Diego, Miami, New Orleans, San Juan, and Galveston, to Mexico, the Bahamas, Disney Castaway Cay, the Caribbean, and Panama Canal. Number five, talking about the decks. Decks one and two are mostly staterooms, with the medical center on deck one. Moving on to deck three, we have Keys, a venue to enjoy live piano music and drinks. Next is O'Gill's Pub, an Irish pub, and is the ship's sports bar. Next is the Sea Treasure Shop and Fathoms, which is a nightclub and also hosts different games. Next are the guest services and port adventures desk. And aft is Lumiere's, one of the main dining rooms. Next is the Promenade Lounge, a venue to play games and drink. Aft is Rapunzel Royal Table, another main dining room that also offers shows at dinner time. And on deck four aft, there is Animator's Palace Dining Room, another amazing included venue. Moving forward through the Shutter's photo gallery and shops, you'll reach the art gallery. Here, the Starbird hosts D Lounge, where your kids will meet Disney characters and will enjoy a lot of games. Next is the atrium, and here is the Disney vacation planning desk. Forward are the shops and Prelude's Bar, as well as Walt Disney Theater. Deck five forward are staterooms. Next is the Disney's Oceaneer Club, an amazing venue for kids aged three to 12. And Small World Nursery is paid babysitting for six months to three-year-olds. Aft is Buena Vista Theater, a cinema on board. Aft are more staterooms. Planning to sail on board this cruise? Then make sure to check out these cruise essentials before boarding from the link below. Decks six to eight are entirely staterooms. Deck nine forward is the fitness center. Next is the Senses Spa and Salon, which features relaxation therapies. Next is the Quiet Cove Adult Pool. It's an adult-only pool with hot tubs, loungers, and signals bar for amazing cocktails. Next, the port hosts Cove Cafe, and it offers complimentary snacks and coffee. And Starbird is Edge, a club for kids aged 11 to 14. Next is the Family Pool. Here you can relax and enjoy the movies from the giant screen, and you'll enjoy the pizzas from Pinocchio's Pizzeria. Dunkin' Diner will serve a complimentary burger, fries, and more. Next is the Ice Cream and Frozone Treats, a paid yogurt venue. Next is the Aqua Lab, children's pool, splash areas, and slides. Next, the Starbird is Daisy's Delights, a snacks venue, and the port is Beverage Station, and both are complimentary. Aft houses Cabanas, the buffet on board, and it serves multiple food choices. Deck 10 aft is Palo, the specialty Italian venue on board. Next is the Twist and Shout slide entrance. Midship is the Aqua Dunk slide entrance. And forward is the basketball court. And Deck 11 hosts Vibe, the teens club. For accommodations, there are multiple stateroom options. Overall, you will enjoy sailing on board Disney Magic.